Should we have gone into Iraq? No, we went there on faulty intelligence, which told us that Saddam Hussein had a nuclear weapons program. That was a mistake. I think good people relied on intelligence and made the best decision they could. You know, it was just a mistake. I did support the war going in. I thought it was very important that we respond with great vigor to what Al-Qaeda had done to us on 9-11. Do I think that it was a distraction in terms of policymakers' time, in terms of counterterrorism resources? For sure. For sure. I think we should have asked more about, okay, where are these weapons of mass destruction? Saddam himself was not very good at disabusing us of the fact that he didn't have any because he wanted the Iranians and others to think he might have them. You need to have good intelligence and you should question the intelligence. Uh, basically, show me the proof. That's what I wish they'd done. If they had given our inspection process more time, we might have ended up demonstrating that there were no WMD in Iraq. I've always felt like I didn't raise enough questions about the intelligence. There were a handful of people at the top of the administration in Washington that were determined to link the Iraqis with the terrorist situation. But it wasn't the military, and again, I'll say it wasn't the president, it wasn't Secretary Rumsfeld, best I know, because we meet every day on this. The president wanted to go in, and uh, my impression is that Mr. Cheney and Mr. Uh, Rumsfeld wanted to go in, and Mr. Wolf Wolfowitz. The Saddam Hussein re regime was violating the UN no-fly zones, and they were shooting at us on a regular basis. They had legitimate cause to, to want to oppose him. He had a horrible human rights record. He was killing his, his own people. I mean, not by ones and twos. Whether going to war was the right way to do it, I'm not sure. In fact, when Senator Levin asked me, do you have any intelligence that Saddam Hussein intends to attack us? I said, no, that kind of startled him. And he said, well, do you think the likelihood of him attacking us would grow if we attacked him? And I said, probably. I've always been surprised that that didn't have more impact in the Senate. Uh, I think uh, one of the lessons we should have learned is uh, when you send young men and women into harm's way, you better be very careful about how you're going to do it, what are you going in there to do, and uh, how are you going to get out? Extremists, as is normally the case, flood into wherever the, wherever the new fight was. Iraq became a magnet for foreign fighters. What we did wrong was that we did not prepare for the a day after so there was inadequate planning for the occupation of Iraq, uh, inadequate planning uh, and uh, compounded by just uh, poor assumptions, overly optimistic about uh, what the political situation would be after our victory. But at the end of the day, it was a combined civilian military failure there.